Hey, what's going on guys? Sam and Ian here, and today we're going to be uh, working at the Chernobyl uh, reactor power plant. <laughs> hey, what's going on guys? Sam and Ian here. Today we're going to be uh, seeing if we can cause a nuclear meltdown in an RBMK reactor. Anyway, let's get right into it, shall we? So, of course, we have our lovely little reactor here. It is currently offline. There is nothing on. So, the first thing we're going to do is obviously bring it back on. You know, how we're going to do that? We're going to take we're going to take the control rods right out. Mm -hmm. <coughs> that shouldn't that shouldn't cause any problems, right? Like, <laughs> okay, well, it's getting it's getting a little it's getting a little more hot under the collar. Okay, we we got steam. It's This could be a problem. This, 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 this oh. mm. I, I don't know if it's gonna work. Uh, 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 <laughs> where'd the steam go? Uh oh, sh oh shit! It's gonna, it's gonna happen. Oh my god. Oh my god, it actually, that actually worked. <laughs> well, the first try. I mean, this is not actually my first try. That, that's, that's what an RMBK reactor explosion looks like, ladies and gentlemen. And that one smokestack is still going. I wonder if that's actually historically accurate. Wait, was that the only smokestack that was still working? God, look at this. Look at this. There is, there is literally graphite. I think that's graphite. That, no, that's a fuel rod. There's literally a, a fuel rod on the roof. There's a graphite. Oh, it's just the graphite that's on the roof. That is, wow. That is literally, it's, it's literally graphite. I am, I gotta get a Geiger counter. I gotta see how much radiation I'm actually getting. Well, considering I'm looking directly into the core right now from the roof, which... Uh, look at, we're looking at a thousand rads. Eleven hundred rads per second. Like here, this would this would instantly, like honestly, instant. I think this is rads per second, like for the this like for the chunk, and this is for the whole entire environment. I'm not really sure. I don't. I can't read Russian, but we have to make it historically accurate. Look at that. That's that's bad. There's, there's literally broken over. Oh my. This is not. This is bad. Steam out of. <laughs> I honestly didn't expect that to actually work. There. Oh, yep. There's there's the elephant's foot already. It's already coming. It's already coming down. Oh my god. There's actually like freaking fuel rod and stuff. Oh, 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 oh no. Look, uh, it, honestly, that, I really like this. That, this is, that's very accurate. Wow. I, uh, there's a name for this. I don't know what it is exactly. That, that right there is going to be the elephant's foot, guaranteed. We're going to have to come back after, like, everything's done. I mean, everything already is done. Like, look, look at that. That is... The amount of radiation that is everywhere. The control room is a lot farther. I feel like I was think like a half kilometer or maybe more away from the actual. Yeah, I mean the actual like reactor. I'm not really certain on that, so don't do not quote me on that. That's that's not good. We have a small town. Oh 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 my! It's. 
It's actually turning the fucking. It's actually. It's actually turning the trees. It's actually making the trees die. This is literally dead trees. This is literally the red fort. Oh, great! It's raining. I don't think it was. I don't think it was actually raining during the Chernobyl incident. We have a red forest now, which I think is the name of the forest outside of the Chernobyl, like inside the Chernobyl exclusion zone. That is wow. <laughs> that's that's amazing. I mean, you can do, you can literally do this in Minecraft, which is even more amazing. I know we didn't have all these. Things. I know that they didn't have a big giant radiation um, satellite here, but you know, wow, that is that is honestly amazing. I gotta take a screenshot. This is actually I spent way too long, like terrifying, not really terrifying. I had to use warp edit to actually change it, so it would uh, actually, you know, it would obviously actually be like, look like the correct location. There's not a river here, unfortunately, I did not have to do that. Anyway, this is the Chernobyl reactor. Honestly, I'm impressed. It has a lot more to breathe than it did last time when I used like the last covers for the uh, fuel lines. So it actually does make sense. Anyway, that's it for this video guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and subscribe if you guys haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time.